Hello everyone. I believe I had a very, very demonic dream. I was being chased by one or two people. And I am not telling you this dream to give praise to any demons. I am telling you this dream to tell you what you need to do when you have these type of demonic dreams or I guess demonic dreams in general. Anyways, I was being chased by two people which I believe they were demons in disguise. In the dream, I was able to run really fast, jump on trees, like move very, very fast. And in that dream, I could kind of, I would say I could pretty much think the way I think now. So I was running and running and running. And from what I understand, I guess one or two people were still chasing me. After a while, it came to my mind to, I forget the actual words. I believe it came to my mind to I don't know, but let me say it in this way. I either took authority and bind it and cast at them, like I bind and cast you out or I rebuke you in the name of Jesus, something like that. And I believe those two people, which I believe they were demons, it was either one or two people chasing me but when I said what I said and I think I said it in my mind maybe out loud but probably in my mind I believe those people stopped chasing me and as I speak about it I can feel like a sensation come over me like a demonic feeling which I rebuke right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Anyways, after they stopped chasing me, I believe one of them said something demonic as if it was like a curse. Saying something that you will get some stuff, some type of bumps all over your arms or some type of real bad thing all over your arms and when that person said it which I believe it was a demon I rebuked it like I rebuked that I forget my actual words but I rebuked it in Jesus name you really need to listen to me I believe many dreams that we have are not really dreams if you know what I am saying. I believe much of those dreams are actually real. Maybe things that are going on in the spirit realm. You may believe I am insane. You may believe I don't know what I am speaking of. You may believe whatever. but. Don't let people speak curses over your life. No matter if it is in a dream or in real life. As I stated, I believe those two people that were chasing me were demons. Demons in disguise. So if you have a dream and something really, really bad happened, when you wake up, pray about it. God, I had this dream. 
I don't know what it really means, but uh, this happened and that happened. If it is for my bad, I rebuke it in Jesus' name, in Jesus Christ's name. I will be saved. Nothing like that will happen to me in Jesus Christ's name. You may say that, Uncle Kev, you are paranoid. It is only a dream, blah, 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 blah. You can think what you want. You can say what you want. But if you have the ears to hear, listen. What that demon told me was trying to, I believe that demon was trying to get me to accept it. To not, if I am saying the right word, to not contest it. I have contested it and I believe I will still continue to pray against what that demon said in that dream because <laughs> i am telling you i believe that dream was so lifelike i believe many of you all have or had dreams like this and maybe in those dreams demonic things has happened maybe you did not pray against what happened and maybe some things that happened in your dream happened to you in real life well i believe right now it is time to contest it pray against it god uh two years ago this thing happened that thing happened in the name of Jesus Christ, I rebuke it right now. In the name of Jesus Christ, every curse, every lie, every trap, I destroy it right now. I break it right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Break that stuff. You don't have to give in to demons. You don't have to submit yourselves to demons. Just because a demon wants to curse you doesn't mean that you should take it. When you are living for Jesus Christ, we are higher. We are superior to demons when we are submitting ourselves to Jesus Christ. If you don't choose to serve Jesus Christ, huh, you are in trouble. Let me stop here. May God bless us.